Hi friends, in this tutorial I am going to explain you 6 different types of borders for your project. For the first border, you have to make a chain 5, turn your work. So in this chain 5, last 2 chains you can see right. So here in this 2 chains you have to make a double crochet. So 1 double crochet in last 2 chains and then skip 3 stitches. 1, 2, 3. In the 4th stitch make a slip stitch. Then again chain 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then make a double crochet in the last before stitch. And then double crochet in the last stitch. So like that you have to repeat. Now skip 3 stitches. 1, 2, 3 and then in the next stitch make a slip stitch. So in this stitch you should have a count of multiples of 4 plus 1. Okay. So uh, make a stitches like that and then you just make a chain 4, 4, 4, 4. Last extra 1 chain you have to add it. So like this way you have to proceed with the pattern. It's very simple pattern but it looks very unique in your project. You can use any type of uh, a project like scarf or dress sweater so anywhere you can add this border it looks too uh, pretty for your dress or sweater or baby dress kind of stuff okay so like this you have to repeat till the end so i have completed i have reached the end so I'll show you how you finish this border. So make a chain 5 and then double crochet, 2 double crochet in the last 2 chains. And then skip 3 stitches, make a last stitch. You have to make a slip stitch to finish this round. I don't have the exact count so that's why I am making like this. If you are having um, exact count like multiples of 4 plus 1, you can make this border for your dress. Okay, this is the first border and you can definitely try this one for your project. And this is the second border. This is also very simple. So for this border also, you have to make a chain 6, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Turn your work okay that border we have made chain 5 now you have to make chain 6 skip one chain make a slip stitch in the next chain and then in the next chain make a single crochet and then half double crochet in the next chain double crochet in the next chain and then triple crochet in the next chain so that you will get the nice triangle kind of border like this it looks like this now you have to skip one two three four and then make a slip stitch so you have to skip four stitches make a slip stitch it looks too good and then do the similar way chain six so one two three four five six skip one chain make a slip stitch in the next chain and then single crochet in the next chain half double crochet in the next chain double crochet in the next chain triple crochet in the next chain Then skip 4 stitches and make a slip stitch. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4. So you have to repeat like this. For this border, you will have to do multiples of 5 plus 1 chain count. Okay. If you make a chain like 5, 5, 5 and then adding extra 1 chain in the last and you can use this border for any kind of project. 
like uh, the same way scarf sweater or any kind of project you can add this one blanket even blanket also you can add so you can definitely try this one repeat like this till the end of this round so I have completed now this is the last triangle stitch I am going to finish it off so by making a slip stitch and then again make a ch 6 chains skip 1 chain make a slip stitch in the next and then single crochet in the next half double crochet in the next double crochet in the next chain and then triple crochet in the next chain so now skip four stitches and then make a slip stitch in the last stitch okay you just try this pattern definitely it looks look very elegant of your any crochet project okay so this is how it looks like so another border this is the third one it is also very pretty for this you have to make a chain 3 turn your work skip 2 stitches and then make a double crochet in the next stitch chain 1 and then skip the previous stitch and make a double crochet in the previous next like this now you have to skip again 2 stitches make a double crochet in the next stitch chain one and then skip previous one stitch and then make a double crochet in the next stitch so like this way you have to repeat you have to make a cross stitch for this stitch the chain should be multiples of three plus two you have to make a chain three 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 and then you have to add plus two chains in the last okay so multiples of three plus two just proceed with the cross stitch pattern just repeat like this till the end so I have completed now this is the last stitch so chain 1 and then make a double crochet and then double crochet in the last stitch to finish this round okay now chain one turn your work as i explained i don't have exactly multiple so that's why i'm just managing with the stitches but if you have exact count you just do with the pattern now make a chain one turn your work single crochet the same stitch and next stitch and then in the chain one space make a single crochet chain three single crochet okay and then single crochet in the next stitch here single crochet in the next you have to make a single crochet in every stitch and then but in the chain one space you have to make single crochet chain three single crochet chain three single crochet and then single crochet in the next two stitches now again chain one space make a single crochet chain three single crochet to repeat the same So it looks like this so good now you just complete till the end so i have completed now at the end 
you have to make a single crochet here and then chain one space make single crochet chain three single crochet and then single crochet in the next stitch then single crochet in the third chain to finish this round okay so this is what it looks like you can just add any kind of your project as usual okay so you definitely try this one it will be very easy and then this is the fourth border this is the floral kind of stitch okay so for this pattern you have to make chain three this is the third chain have to skip one two three four so you have to skip four stitches and then make a double crochet in the next stitch so three double crochet you have to make so this is the second double crochet this is the third double crochet and then chain three four five so you have to make chain five and then make three double crochet in the same stitch you have to form a shell so one two three like this now one two three four skip four stitches make a double crochet in the next stitch and then one two three four skip four stitches make a three double crochet one two three chain five one two three four five and then three double crochet in the same stitch one two three and then you have to skip four stitches make a double four make a double and then again one two three four have to skip four stitches make a shell so do repeat the pattern for this pattern the chain count should be multiples of 10 plus 1 this is the last shell so skip four stitches make three double crochet and then chain five one two three four five three double crochet in the same stitch one two three then skip four stitches like this okay so skip four one two three four in the last stitch here you have to make a double crochet to finish this round so it looks like this but if you do the second round it will be very nice so chain one turn your work make a single crochet in the same stitch and then in the three uh, double crochet stitches you have to make single crochet in every stitch single crochet single crochet single crochet now in the chain three uh, chain five space here make a single crochet chain five one two three four five make again single crochet in the same space so you have to do it like three times so this is the first one and then chain five one two three four five single crochet in the same space then again chain five one two three four five make a single crochet in the same space like this okay it looks floral 
pattern now make a single crochet in every stitch so single crochet single crochet single and then single crochet single crochet single crochet so again you have to do the same in the chain 5 space so single crochet so like that you can see right so 6 single plus double crochet also on single like so totally 7 single crochet you have to make and then in the chain 5 space make a single crochet chain 5 single so you have to do the same till the end So almost I have completed, make a single crochet in the stitches and then single crochet in the last chain stitch. So this is the pattern looks like. So you can definitely try this one also. This is for shawl, scarf, you can add this one. It's see very pretty edges for your projects but you have to do two rounds to get the nice floral edges now this is the fifth border so you have to start with chain one turn your work make a double crochet in the same stitch you have to do the picot stitch okay in this border now chain three one two three make a slip stitch in the two loops here like this make a slip stitch okay now again make a double crochet in the same stitch and then chain three make a picot so this is the picot stitch so you have to do it for the three double crochets so and then another double crochet in the same stitch chain 3 and make a picot like this 1 2 3 so skip 3 stitches make a slip stitch in the next stitch so it looks like this now again you have to do the same chain 1 make a double crochet in the same stitch picot so you have to make 3 double crochet okay in this every double crochet you have to make a picot stitch then skip three do the same till the end in for this uh, border you, you should have the count of the stitches is multiples of four plus one
so you have to repeat the pattern till the end so i have completed it looks like this now this is the last one so make a chain one and do the same double crochet picot then double crochet picot so like that and then skip three stitches make a, a slip stitch in the last stitch to finish this round that's it so you definitely try this border this is also very very pretty for your uh, crochet projects any kind of project you can use this pattern unisex pattern so you can use any type of uh, dresses scarf for anywhere so this is the last border it's also very nice and easy chain 3 turn your work make two double crochet in the same stitch like this now 1 2 3 so skip two stitches in the third stitch make a single crochet chain 3 single crochet and then skip two stitches make five double crochet in the next stitch 1 2 3 4 five and then skip two stitches make a single crochet chain three single crochet in the next stitch and then skip two stitches make a shell for this border the chain count is multiples of 6 plus 1 okay so i just repeat the pattern So I've completed. Now skip two stitches, make a single crochet, chain three, single crochet, and then skip two stitches, make three double crochet to finish this round. Because we have started with three double, so you have to finish with three double. So this is how it looks like. Definitely try this border for your project. Very very nice. Okay, so which one you like most? You just add in the comment. If you have any doubts, you can ask me in the comment section. I will definitely respond you. So please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.